Good morning, my friends, and happy Friday. Today is Friday, and you know what that means. On my channel, it is menu plan and grocery haul day. But today we do not have a grocery haul, just a menu plan. We are eating out of the freezer and the pantry, and next week I am hoping to do a grocery haul. So without further ado, we're gonna get started on this. We've got some new recipes this week that I'm very excited to try, and some old favorites. So, and once again, trying for the ham loaf because I've had that on my menu three times and still haven't had it. So this week we are having it. Hopefully we will see. So let me turn you around, show you what we were having in our house for breakfast, for lunch, and for dinner this week. Okay, so for breakfast this week, on Sunday, I'm going to make stuffed French toast and sausage. Monday, eggs, a bagel, and sausage. Tuesday, some blueberry pancakes. Wednesday and Thursday, it's a new recipe. It's breakfast bundles. We're having chicken bundles for dinner this week and I started thinking, hmm, I bet I can make them into breakfast bundles. So we're gonna give that a try. Friday is our day of Lenten fasting. Saturday, an omelet and bacon as always. Sunday, not sure on lunch yet. It just depends on what's happening and who's hungry. Monday, a picky plate, turkey, cheese, vegetables, fruit, whatever needs to be used up from the refrigerator. Tuesday, yeah, I know, mommy dogs again because, what, it's been three weeks and I still haven't had them, so hopefully mommy dogs on Tuesday. Wednesday, a chef salad. Thursday, another picky plate. Friday, our day of fasting, and Saturday, we're going to make personal pizzas for lunch. I don't have points because I'm not sure exactly, you know, what we're using or anything yet. And for dinner this week on Sunday, I have been craving burgers on the grill and fries with some deviled eggs. Monday, chicken bundles and a vegetable. Tuesday is takeout Tuesday. Not sure what we're going to do for takeout because a lot of places even though they're allowed to be open for takeout and delivery, are closing down, so not sure yet. Our um, three favorite Asian places are closed, and I really am hankering for Chinese, so I might have to try a new one. We'll see. Wednesday, a new recipe, creamy pasta and shell. Well, actually, no, I wrote that wrong. It's creamy beef and pasta and a salad and probably some kind of vegetable in there too. Or maybe some bread with that. No, we have pasta. Thursday, ham loaf, hopefully. I, I mean at this time, we're have, definitely having the ham loaf with sweet potatoes and a vegetable. Friday, shrimp scampi over pasta. Saturday, chicken Italiano sandwiches. It's a sandwich that a local pizzeria makes that I really like, so I'm gonna try to duplicate it. It's just um, like a seared chicken breast that's been marinated in like Italian dressing with roasted red peppers and provolone or whatever kind of cheese you have laying around. And I still have a couple of the uh, Trader Joe's, the uh, ciabatta rolls left. So that is what I'm going to use on there or put those on, we'll see with some fries and a vegetable. And then for dessert, I planned in a dessert for Saturday. We're gonna have Built Bar S'mores for dessert. If you don't know what a Built Bar S'more is, you take a Built Bar and you cut it in half and you microwave it for 18 seconds. And then you slap it on a graham cracker and top it with a, a graham cracker square. You take one graham cracker sheet, break it in half to make two squares, just like you would a s'more. You put that on there and oh my, they are delicious. So that is what I'm gonna have for dessert on Saturday night. Exercise, just same as always, between the hit and the running, mixing it up certain days. And Friday will be my day of rest, as always, because of the fasting. So there it is, that is the menu for the week. It's what we are eating for breakfast, lunch, and dinner in our house. So there you have it. And as always, if you would like a copy of the blank menu planner, you can go right to my website, jonespointofplate.com, 
and there's a tab that says free printables. I have several different versions that you can just download and print for free. And as always on Saturdays, my weekly menu will be up on the home page of my website with the clickable links to each recipe. You can also scroll down on the home page and you will see a spot to enter your email. If you enter your email address, every time I upload a recipe, it's automatic. You get the recipe right into your email. And also on Saturdays when I upload the menu, you get a note from me and um, the menu. So if you'd like to do that, I would love to have you as part of my community on my website, as well as part of my community here on YouTube. So if you haven't already subscribed, I would love it if you would hit that subscribe button and click the notification bell so you know every time I upload. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Leave me a comment below. Let me know what is on your menu this week. Let me know if any of these things sound good to you. Let me know if there's anything specific you would like to cook with me. And I will do that too. So have a fantastic week, everyone. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay positive, and most important, try to stay on track. I know it's not easy during this time of uncertainty, but it'll be better for us. It'll keep us healthier. If we can, just try to stay on track a little bit. Have a great day, and I will be back tomorrow with a day in the life, full day of eating for you.